Wakeley and Rossington put Northants in charge at the end of day one. Northamptonshire have responded to the painful losses of Duckett and Gleeson with the enterprising overseas signings of Temba Bavuma, Blessing Muzarabani and the world's top-ranked all-rounder Jason Holder. 2016 champions Middlesex will be looking to bounce back to the top division and will be helped by there being three promotion places as Division 1 moves to 10 teams in 2020. Northamptonshire made a very watchful start against Middlesex's much vaunted pace attack before Newton fell LBW to Murta for seven in the 14th over. Vasconcelos and Wakeley counter-attacked, taking a particular liking to Finn, before Vasconcelos edged through to the keeper with Murta picking up his second wicket of the day. Wakeley was joined by Cobb, but not for long, as he fell for nine not long after lunch. Murtagh picking up another wicket, Roland Jones with the catch this time. Wakeley continued to lead from the front, bringing up his 50 in a partnership with Richard Keogh. All that before perishing to a loose shot in the evening after getting to a well-made 76. Keogh fell for 46, giving Stephen Finn his first wicket of the season and bringing West Indies captain Jason Holder to the crease. He crashed his second ball to the boundary. Finn conceded three boundaries in an over, two of them to Rossington, who brought up his 50 from 57 balls in the following over. Rossington eventually perished for 67 to give Roland Jones his first wicket in a year. But Holder soldiered on to make it Northamptonshire's day as they finished on 310 for six.